he could be dealing with the grown man. Like, I just spoke to two women, and they both said he was going to call me. I just want to get him on the line. I want to know what the fuck on his mind, why he got two children naming him out. So he can be dealing with the grown man. He can deal with the men. Why he want to deal with the children when he can deal with the men? Yeah. Oh, they don't know what we talking about. Charleston White, man, he uh made some comments about Ken and Trudy Boots' son. You know what I mean? These children, these man. So you got Ti, you got Charleston White. This thing is going viral everywhere. I mean, I wish things could be the, on the better sides for all of them, but it, it's spiraling out of control. My personal opinion. Um, I hope somebody can intervene and and dead the situation real quick, cause everybody keeps saying it went left already. Um, once you talk about folks and them kids and all that, I feel is left, but this ain't the real left yet. So it's one of them things where I want to hear from y'all after the video is done. Let's engage in the comment sections but first thing i need y'all to do is hit the like button hit the notification bell thank you for rocking out with the i smoke hip-hop live platform i am your guy dj bless one salute to the kings and the queens salute oh they don't know what we talking about charleston white man he uh made some comments about and and i guess he, he disguised himself as a community leader that's not leadership he disguised himself as an activist. That's yeah. not activism. You using hate, talking about you hate boosting. And then you bringing up children in the process of talking about you hating another man. Like, man, bro, that's... Right. How, how did he bring, how did he bring King no and Trudeau anyway? What did he do with As a concerned it? father, that's what I'm asking. Because, bro, that don't sound... That don't sound like leadership. That don't sound like activism. That sounds like a predator taking advantage of some children because he don't want to approach no grown men. That's what that sound like. So he feel like you I mean, like call the people, man. And I've been waiting on. The, I mean, his people. He got two ladies, two women call me back. He got two women. Like I just spoke to two women, and they both said he was gonna call me. I just want to get him on the line. I want to know what the fuck on his mind. Why he got two children naming him out? He can be dealing with the grown men. He can deal with the men. Why he want to deal with the children when he can deal with the men? Yeah. Oh, they don't know what we talking about. Charleston White, man, he uh made some comments about Ken and Trudy Boots' son. You know what I mean? These children, these yeah, children he going did. through their own things <laughs> as young teenagers do on their way to adulthood. They had no words with the man. They had negated the man. No reason to speak their name. He got an issue with Boosie, whatever that issue is. He say he hate Boosie. And then he say, and I don't like your little ugly ass kid. And then the little yellow nigga, King, who be with him. You see what I'm saying? So, like, bro, yeah. that's predatory. That's predatory, man. I just want to know what's going on. I ain't coming there's no gangster, no goon. I ain't in no gang, my nigga. I ain't in no game. I'm a concerned parent in the community right now. I'm in the community right now. Ain't no police around. I'm in the community right now, bro. I don't need no police moving around. I don't live in fear. I ain't never did nothing to say it, nothing that I can't carry on my shoulders wherever I go. I'm just asking you as a concerned father, as a concerned parent, what motivated you to put my motherfucking son in your mouth? That's it. See, he know he gonna play police games, though. That's it, bro. You can say what you want about me. He done said shit about me in the past. I ignore it and I keep it pushing. I don't care. Nigga can't goddamn attack my credibility. This shit is etched in stone. I don't give a damn about it. But when you start talking about my children and my mama calling me, his mama calling me, my, you know, my, my daughter and my family calling me, bro, I got to figure out what's up with you, my man. Yeah, like, you can't just be letting that go on. But look, he talking about he's a comedian now, though. comedian come with jokes. Jokes have a beginning, a premise, yeah. and a punchline. Show me the punchline. He ain't have no punchline. I mean, but if you don't like Boosie, go. keep talking about Boosie. Why you got to bring Tootie into it? What kind of grown-ass man, yeah. Yeah. what kind of grown-ass man talk about a motherfucking child? I don't like him, but I'm not gonna talk about his child. I'm not gonna say nothing about his child. I'm not gonna say nothing about his son, his daughter, or nothing. It's, some, it's somebody mustache. It's I have somebody no idea, mustache. Man. I have I, my own personal opinion.
right with opinion right about right it, but right I ain't, it ain't even about that. It ain't about that. You just talk yeah. about people's children, bro. No, I'm talking about Charles, Charles the White. Charles the White. It's something, it's something ain't right about it, man. The thing is, then you want to hide behind the police. You want to start fires and then hide behind the motherfucking uh, firemen. I ain't even know Fannie Willis had an Instagram. Sure she do. And Fannie's doing, hey man, listen, bro. Yeah, he, 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 he played Fannie Willis. Uh, Willis. Fannie Willis Fanny 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 Willis. Fannie Willis, I'm sure if that was a job for her to do over here with my son or me, that motherfucking job would be done. That shit would be done. Ain't nobody finna stop yeah. Fannie Willis from doing her job. Everybody know that. She don't give a damn who you is, what you got going on. If this a job to be done, it's gonna be done. So if King done fucked up, his ass gonna have to answer for it. But me as a father, I want to talk to this grown ass man. Why uh, are you talking about my son? I want to know. These children, these yeah, children going through their own things <laughs> as young teenagers do on their way to adulthood. They had no words with the man. They had they gave this man no reason to speak their name. He got an issue with Boosie, whatever that issue is. He say he hate Boosie. And then he say, and I don't like your little ugly kid. And then the little yellow nigga. King who be with him, you see what I'm saying? So, like, bro, yeah. that's predatory. That's predatory, man. I just want to know what's going on. I ain't coming, there's no gangster, no goon. I ain't in no gang, my nigga. I ain't in no gang. I'm a concerned parent in the community right now. I'm in the community right now. Ain't no police around me. I'm in the community right now, bro. I don't need no police move around. I don't live in fear. I ain't never did nothing to say it, nothing that I can't carry on my shoulders wherever I go. I'm just asking you as a concerned father, as a concerned parent, what motivated you to put my motherfucking son in your mouth? That's it. See, he know he gonna play police games, though. That's it, bro. You can say what you want about me. He done said shit about me in the past. I ignored it. I keep it pushing. I don't care. Nigga can't goddamn attack my credibility. This shit is etched in stone. I don't give a damn about it. But when you start talking about my children and my mama calling me, his mama calling me, my you know, my, my daughter and my family calling me, bro, I got to figure out what's up with you, my man. Yeah, like, you can't just be letting that go on. But look, he's talking about he's a comedian all, now, though. A comedian come with jokes. Jokes have a beginning, a premise, yeah. and a punchline. Show me the punchline. <laughs> He ain't have no, but he just, I mean, he just but if don't you don't like Boosie, folks. keep talking about Boosie. Why you got to bring Tootie into it? What kind of grown-ass man, yeah, yeah. what kind of grown-ass man talk about a motherfucking child? I don't like him, but I'm not going to talk about his child. I'm not going to say nothing about his child. I'm not going to say nothing about his son, his daughter, or nothing. It's, some, it's somebody mustache. It's Man, y'all tell me how y'all feel about the whole situation and the conversation. Do you feel like Charleston White is wrong? T.I. is wrong? His son? I don't know what y'all feel. I can't swear y'all opinions. I didn't even give mine personally. I'm going to do a live later. But, you know, I rock with Charleston. I rock with T.I. I even like his family. You feel me? They was on that VH1 show. I forgot what the name of it was. But I like what I even like watching Run DMC. Um, What's Russell Simmons, brother? I'm, I'm tripping. Run. Run's house. Um, it, you feel me? Seen Angela Simmons and everybody still being united to this day. Digi Simmons. I like when I see family shows together and all that because I'm a family man at the end of the day, man. So I hope this thing get better for all of them. Y'all hit that like button, that notification bell. Love your family. Love your kids. Stay blessed.